Hello everybody, my name is Insomnia Anvil and welcome to a game called Sarah is Missing. This is a horror game that you can get on your computer or if you're cool and into immersion you can get it on your cell phones which is what I've done because I am a child of immersion. It is a horror game and uh, one of my workmates suggested this. I don't really know much about it but all I know is that you find someone's phone, that person being Sarah, I think that's how you pronounce it, it's S-A-R-A, -A. so Sarah not Sarah, not sure, doesn't really matter, anyway, so we've found her phone, and we've got to find out where she is, and if we can return it to her, so, let's go through over personal shit, which, not really into, but hey, that's okay, and, uh, um, no, oh, am I supposed to say yes, oh, okay, that's a cute kitty, oh, there we go, okay, sweet, I think. I think this is good. System restore, yeah? Okay, cool. So I've got all of our functionalities back. That's good. Storing ir Iris. I started to say Iris, but it's it's Iris. What the fuck? Whoa, what the fuck was that, man? Uh, wa welcome back, Sarah. Uh, this phone appears to... Can I... Cl Welcome back, Sarah. This phone appears to be damaged, and you do not appear to be Sarah. Have we met? Who the fuck are you? Uh, can I click on it? Oh, I can too. Okay. Oh, I can keyboard this. Uh, I. Uh, I'm. Oh, it's, it's pretty. I'm. Bob. Yes. Not. Okay. Uh. Oh, okay, so it gives you the option to type, but you don't really get to type. I'm not Sarah. Would you kindly return this property back to Sarah Young? Uh, sure. You know where she is? Based on your response, I assume she is not with you. Nope. Uh, I don't even know her. Is this an AI? Oh, that's cool. It seems that the last video she took implies that she is in danger. Would you like to watch it and help me verify? Not really. Actually, I kind of just want to throw this phone away now. What the fuck? Uh, let's see what you got. Yep. Why not? Oh, shit. No, I don't want to watch that. I don't want to watch this. I hear footsteps. <laughs> Sarah, the camera quality on your phone sucks. Get a better phone. One that doesn't have the stalky AI. This is the only file left at this moment. The rest of the content seems to be deleted or intentionally damaged. Shit. Ah. Uh, how much can you fix? It appears that only 14.3% of this device is operational. Okay. I think Sarah is in trouble. No, she looks like she needs help. That sounds like a smarter thing to say. Yes, it would appear to be so. I am the mobile's personal assistant in Intelligent Recognitive Iconolatry System, Iris. Iconolatry? Okay, I c can't pronunciate words, blah. So it is an AI. That's, that's kind of cool, kind of creepy at the same time, but hey, it's the future. I don't know how far into the future, but we've got AIs in our phones now, that's cool. It is in my best interest to locate her, and it would be in your good conscience to help me find her. An AI that cares about its user. That's cool. Uh... Bleh. Why do you want to help find Sarah? She is my owner. Mm -hmm. I want to make sure she is safe. Yes? It is my prime directive. Oh shit! No. Prime directive. It is my prime directive. You know, when people, when, when robots say it's their prime directive to do something... Oh shit, okay, you know what? We all know what happens then. Uh, hang on, you, you, you won. Oh. You sound human. Yes. I, I want. We are wasting precious time here. Wait, you want what? Will you help me find Sarah? Is that you referring to before, like you saying you want, and then I said you're human, and then you're like, yes, I want, because you sound... Uh... Can I say no? 
I don't want it to end if I say no, so yes. Yes, I'll help you, because I'm a good person, I guess. I guess, you know, hey, whatever. I need to restore as much of the Ooh. content in this phone as I am able to. Please press the back button, then tap and hold anywhere on the home screen to proceed. Okay, so I have memos. Find Sarah. If I include in Sarah's phone, which might reveal where she is. Okay, so what? Hold it. Hold it down. Oh! Hey, Iris. I believe I can recover some of this phone's data. That's good, I guess. Would you like me to restore them now? Nah, I'll do it in a few hours, you know, like, whatever. Of course I want you to do it now. I am starting the restore process now. Remember, you can tap and hold at any part of the phone to ask me for help with anything. Okay. But if it is something out of my capabilities, I will let you know with a beep. Messages restored. Mail restored. What else is restored? Gallery restored. Oh, great. I get to go through all of our shit. Music restored. Ah, oh, I get to see what kind of music she's into. Phones restored. Games restored. Notes restored. That's good. Got any notes? Eden, there's no place I call... Oh, 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 what? I don't know how I feel about going through her shit, but... I guess it has to be done. As I calculated, only a minor portion of the phone's contents are available. Mm. What do I do if I find something interesting? You may tap and hold on anything interesting or suspicious. I will lend my assistance and look into it. Okay. Uh, thank you, I guess? Uh, okay, I, f I feel like I should just go through the notes first. Eden, there's no place I call home, but it's warm in between your tone size. Your tone size? Like Winter Tigers listening to God whispering goodnight from nowhere. Okay, uh, static. You loved me yesterday, but today, no. Today you love yourself, and I loved you yesterday. Okay, we live from notification to notification. Wow, this, this girl has some serious thoughts. And I giggled, and I didn't know that when I giggled, my ass giggles too. Must have a big ass. Nice. <laughs> I'm sorry. And I think about being spanked by his for What the f- Okay. And I giggle no more. Wow. That's, uh... Nice. Sarah, you're a bit kinky, girl. You know that? A little bit we on the weird side. Okay. Oh, uh, let's go through your music first. I don't know how I feel about... Going through her messages. And is nigh carbon copied. Oh, that's cool. Okay, anyway, moving on. Alright, messages. Yay. Uni group. Chat unavailable. Okay, never mind. James. Coffee. 1800 hours. Yeah, sure, but let's make it 6.30 p.m. Uh, 6.30 it is. Bring the stuff I gave you yesterday. Next time, bring your own research, okay? Don't be like that. I gotta go. Later's James. Okay. James and Jill. Ugh, he's so annoying. I'm so over him. Forget it, Sarah. You're on your own now. We have our ups and downs. It's normal. Why don't you do something fun? Something crazy? I mean, you're doing it now. Your endless research on the paranormal. I don't know. I guess you're right. You are the genius in our batch. Ugh, I'm so stupid. Yeah, you are sometimes. But go easy on yourself. You just get used to it. It's one thing to break up and another to move on. Can you do me a favor? Oh, okay, so... Guessing Sarah just had a recent breakup. <gasps> Maybe she got abducted by the boy. Oh, shit, that's not good. Meet someone new. Go meet a crazy friend. Try a dating app. You never know. I don't know how to make friends. I already have one crazy friend. I meet someone interesting. I usually just buy them a drink and take them home. Not too sure about dating apps. Oh, okay, so you're a bit of a slut. Okay. <laughs> just kidding. Sometimes I can't tell if you're joking, haha, but put yourself out there, go have a conversation with someone at a cafe or something, a party might not be a bad idea. Have fun, please. I don't know, just try. Okay, fine, fine, I will. You'll be fine. Thanks, Jilly Beans. <laughs> That's a cool name. No problem, I'm here for you. If you need me, saving you has become my speciality. Haha, <laughs> very funny. Blah. You'll be alright. I know, I know. Okay, so that was, how long ago? The fourth. Oh, wow, okay, so a few weeks. Hey, have a safe flight, good luck, and hope you save lots of lives there. Thanks, I'll be back sooner than you think. We'll miss you, don't run to zombies and stuff. Even if you do, somehow I think you'll find a cure for it. Ha, uh, I just might take care of your... Take care, you. Okay, so I'm guessing Jill is a nurse or a doctor or something? Mm. Buddy. Mm. Okay, hey buddy, how's it going? 13th of Feb. So, how was your trip? It was terrible. Oh, why was it terrible? Sigh. Uh, 
<sighs> Derek broke up with me. Sorry to hear that. By the way, free this week? No, I'm pretty busy. Got my final thesis to deliver. Wait, hang on a sec. So this happened in February, and I had to chat with Jelly Beans in March. So that was a month. Okay, so they've been broken up for a month now. Okay. Uh, where are we? What is it about? Do you really want to know, buddy? Yeah, sure. I'm doing research on the relativity of ghosts to culture, and how it transcends from verbal tales handed down through the generations to a digital and cyberspace haunting. Okay. By the way, are you into butt stuff? Uh, buddy. Oh, I already dislike this person. I gotta go, buddy. And no, even if I am, you're not it. NP, poke you later. Dude. Ooh. Sarah, why are you friends with this guy? This guy seems like a real fucking dick. It's like, you're, he's like, you're, you're telling him about your stuff, and then he's like, oh yeah, it doesn't fucking care. You into butt stuff? You wanna have sex? Uh, you know, I know you broke up with your boyfriend not so long ago, but, uh, or however long that was, but, uh, you wanna have sex? No? Okay. Nice weather today. Could be better. Wind doesn't feel as nice as it was yesterday. Hang on, how long was that? Oh, okay, so that's like a whole month later. Can I send you some pics? I don't think so, buddy. I bet you'll lie. Dude, what the fuck is your problem? I know it's been a month now, but come on, people need a little bit longer than that. No, I don't think so. It's off my... P Jesus! Yes, I figured. It's... B you know when they say it's big, you know it's not. Like, yeah, no, sorry. It's probably like four inches. Fuck off, thanks. Bye! I don't really care. Would you like to say... Dude! Sarah, just block the guy. No! Would you like to say... I don't know how I feel about reading these messages now. Can I see you? Not at the moment. Can I see... I don't have a penis... <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was a good one. I meant your tits. I bet you have nice tits. I do, actually. Can I see them? Nope. Bend over. Sorry, I'm just bored. I know, buddy. Go watch porn. Internet here is slow. Not my problem. Yeah, fair enough. Well, have fun there. Thanks, buddy. I don't know why I'm friends with you, really. Lucky me, huh? Sarah, just... Remove him. All you have to do, it's like a few clicks and he's gone. You don't have to listen to him trying to, you know, be pervy. Another month. Hey, do you like tapes and CDs? Yeah, been a while since I had them, though. Good, because I'm a... <laughs> I'm going to tape my penis on your head and you can see these nuts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I've seen that before. It's, <laughs> it's pretty good, but fuck's sake. Okay, buddy, that was actually funny. I wasn't really joking. And I'm out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Ah, yeah, okay, this must be one of her friends. 27th of April, so this is a few months after they broke up. Wait, this is 2016 still, and we've got AIs. We're 2016, yo, real life, where the fuck's our AIs? Hey, Buddhalicious, you okay? Feeling like the dumps? Come join me and some abs at the club, abs. Sorry, babe, got assignment, can't do it. Skip it, babes, they have abs like, like... Like abs, like Tarzan abs. Oh, well, what the fuck are you doing, Sarah? Go, go get them abs, girl. Like, holy shit, have you seen Tarzan? Oh my god. No homo. Sorry. You know I won't want to miss hanging out with you guys, but some other time. It's ladies night, and besides, we've got ice cream. You need a break. Girls love them ice cream. Come on, mama. You know how them ice cream melts down abs. Wow, you are... Mm. Okay. Tempting, but I'm gonna pass. Besides, I haven't got clubbing in years. I haven't gone clubbing in years. I don't really like ice cream. What the heck is wrong with you, Sarah? Everybody likes ice cream. But, hmm, chocolate lava brownies does sound so good. That actually does sound pretty good, actually. I would have that and the ice cream. That way, the lava brownies melts the ice cream, and, like, you pour the ice cream, which is like a cream now, over the brownies, and, ha. Oh, hmm. Anyway, celebrating freedom, you need a night out with me to forget all your troubles. I won't force you, though. I'll have one on your behalf. <laughs> Thanks. I will catch up with you some other time, and don't overdo it. Watch your calories. Yeah, you, you fatty bum. Ha, ah, bitch, bitch. You know they love me love handles. Them puppies wild, mama. It's true, guys do like a bit of meat on their woman. And their, their boys, you know. I'm not, not that they're meat. Not, not trying to sound like that. That's not what I'm getting at. What I'm saying is don't be anorexic, girls. You know, you can have a bit of bit of fat on you, it's good, it's healthy. Anyway. Hey, where have you been? Why didn't you reply to me? I texted you last night, I heard you went out with Faith last night. Bitch, why didn't you call me? I'm always the last to know, what the fuck? Let's get coffee. Oh, I'm like that too. Everyone always texts me last, and it's really annoying. 
or I don't don't get told at all, and then when I end up in a situation, and everyone's like, what the fuck did you know? I'm like, you guys didn't tell me. Anyway, enough of my own problems. Let's get coffee. I've got news. I met someone last night at the club. Man, those dimples. Sarah, you there? I tried to call you, but I can't get through. Call me, okay? Hey, Sarah, I'm worried. You've been, uh, you're not normally like this. Okay. This has been going on for five hours, almost six. Okay, that's not good. Can I click on this? Yes, I can! Sarah's actions. It is unusual. How do you know what is unusual? Through various calculations of Sarah's regular activities and choices that she makes in her daily life. This is creepy. I can simulate and deduce that her actions or inactions in this situation does not match her past behavior. Wow, that's actually kind of cool. Like, AIs can, like, get to know you through your actions on your phone and shit. That's awesome. What is Sarah usually like? Like, usually. Her recent behavior shows that she is suffering from abrupt and apparently unaccountable change of moods. Well, that's because she's got broken up. Possibly due to her relationship issue. Yep. But I am no doctor. <laughs> You're freaky, Iris. I agree with you. <laughs> this Iris is kind of cool. Like, I'm kind of freaked out, but that's pretty cool. Okay, so I found something. Um, actually, when was that? The 1st of May. So I'm guessing this is when she disappeared. The 1st of May. Okay. Um, Derek. Okay. Hey, you there? What do you want? Nothing. I just... I'm about to board. Why should I care? Well... That's one of the problems, ain't it? You barely care. Oh, this is the boyfriend. Ex-boyfriend. It's a very important detail. Did you text me to tell me that you're such an asshole? This is on the 14th of February. Isn't that Valentine's? Yeah, it is. Okay. Look, I didn't mean... I, I definitely didn't want to hurt you. I mean, I wish things were different. I don't want us to end. I guess th that's what I'm trying to say. I, I don't know. Ugh! I'm, tr I'm trying to tell you that this is not how I planned things to be. Things ended when you left. You left. You and your planning, enough plans, you plan and plan and plan, but you never do anything. All you do is run and work and use your work as an excuse to avoid confronting the issue. I think you just described yourself. Why do you always do this? And you keep blaming my work for our problems, stop blaming shit on me. And these girls naked or not- Well, what? They are not our problems, it's me and- what about naked girls? I'm pretty sure if you're in a relationship, you shouldn't be seeing other naked girls. Unless, of course, you guys are into that weird shit. Which you clearly are not. Well, you might be, but she's not. Anyway, you, and you're the one that keeps avoiding this shit. Shifting problems here and there. How about, I don't feel like listening to your shit right now. Haven't you done enough? No, you need to listen. I'm trying to tell you. No, I don't want to listen. I'm tired of your lies and shit. Baby, listen, please. Ooh, if you have nothing else to say, then stop texting me. I'm done with you. Done. I can't believe you decided to do this. Not that I fucking celebrate it, but it's Valen fucking time. Oh, what the shit? You broke up with her on Valentine's Day? Or so, you guys, well, something happened on Valentine's Day. Who the fuck leaves the girlfriend to fly back to another country to photograph nude woman? Holy shit, dude. On Valentine's Day. Jesus. And not have the balls to tell me not- What? You lying piece of shit. Oh my dude. You went. You left her. You flew back to a different country or wherever. Or down to a different city or wherever. However far. It doesn't matter how far you flew. You left your girlfriend on Valentine's Day. To photograph nude woman. That's messed up. I mean. If it's a hobby. That's messed up. Which is a really fucking weird hobby if you're in a relationship. But if that's your job. Dude. That might not have been the best idea. But Sarah, if you're dating a guy and you're not into him having a, you know, nude modeling job, then maybe you shouldn't be dating him, you know? But fuck, Derek, what is your problem, man? Not telling you something is not the same as lying. I told you, it's a last minute gig. Okay, so it's a, yeah, it's a job. It's a fashion shoot, baby, let's get that straight. How is it fashion if you're nude? Like, there's, I mean, there's, you can be fashionably nude, but you don't try to sell nudity in fashion, right? I don't know, I'm not a fucking celebrity. You wanna play technicality with me now, are you fucking serious? Go away, Derek, just go away. You're good at that, at least. Ooh, that's one damn thing you're good at. Just go. No thanks to you, I don't even fucking know how to get back to my... Charlotte? Our, sorry, my mistake, it's my Charlotte now. I have to figure this out. Bye, Derek. Have a nice fucking flight. Sarah, baby, I'm sorry. I'll make it up to you. You there? Wait, when is this?
Okay, it doesn't matter. Uh, hey, I'm boarding now. Take care. Sorry. Bye. Hey, how are you? Been a while. Hey. Okay, so this is... That was on the 14th, and this is the 3rd. Been a while. Hey. Baby, talk to me, plus. I'm so sorry. I miss you. What are you up to now? Sarah, talk to me, please. Baby, I'm not your baby. Stop tasting me. I need to move on. Okay, got it. Bye, Sarah. Wow. That was abrupt. Holy shit. See, I, like, I don't feel good going through these messages. I mean, it's interesting because it's gossip, but, like, I feel bad because I'm invading th th these people's privacy. Like, except for Buddy. Buddy can get fucked. Uh, hi, Mom. Just wanted to check in. Derek and I have decided to end things. Things were not working out, so... But I'm okay. I'm sorry to hear that, Sarah, but I've always known that Derek could never keep up with you. Best you ended things before it got too serious. What time is your flight back? I can have my driver pick you up from the airport. Right, well, um, actually, don't panic, but I've decided to stay. Sarah, I don't understand. You've just come out of a relationship and you're in a foreign land. Why would you want to stay? I need some time for myself, Mom. Being at home now, just, I can't. What do you mean you can't? You can get on that plane and come home. Mom, no, I can't. I've cancelled the flight tickets already anyway. Why in the world would you do something so stupid as that, Sarah? Mom, listen. Sarah, you come home this instant. I will get my assistant. I will get my assistant to buy you a new ticket right now. Wow, that mom is overbearing as shit. Mom, no, I'm not coming home, and that's final. At least not yet. I don't expect you to understand, but see you when I get back. Okay. Hi, mom. Just to let you know, I've touched down walking to immigration now. Hang on a sec. When was that? Uh, you only stayed for an extra six days. Or maybe they phone called and she ended up having to do it anyway. Huh. Oh no. Oh no, okay, never mind. I thought you were supposed to arrive an hour ago. Got delayed, sorry, I couldn't send you a text. I've got to go into a meeting now, the driver's waiting for you. Okay, see you soon. We'll be back late. We'll talk to you when I come home. Okay. Sarah, I've scheduled for you to meet with the executive creative director of Lloyd Irving, the advertising agency at noon tomorrow. Don't embarrass me, Mum. I have a seminar to go to and we've talked about this already. I'm not changing my major and I'm certainly not going to be a copywriter. Mom, really? Tomorrow's seminar is pretty important for my grades. I can't skip it, even if I wanted to. You're really going to pick your silly research on ghosts, of all things, over possibly working in a top agency. I simply don't understand your fixation on ghosts, Sarah. I've let it go on for too long. I only want to help you build a promising career, not throw it all away just to be a ghost hunter. No, what you're doing is you're trying to shape her into what you want her to be. You're forcing her to make her... You're forcing her to take decisions she doesn't want to do and have a life she doesn't want to lead. Mom, first of all, stop calling it ghost research or ghost anything. It's parapsychology. No, that's literally just a fancy inside name for ghost hunting or ghost research. And secondly, I don't want to be a copywriter like you. It's just not what I want. Parapsychology. Really, that sounds a bit made up, but okay, whatever. Anyway, and I hope you can understand that. Dad would understand. You know the only reason why you can go on and do all your nonsense is because I allow it. Ooh, yep. Ah, I don't like this mother. Mm, mm -mm. I'm trying to make sure you have a future, at the very least, a good paying job or a job that pays anything. Wow. How are you going to pay the bills with this kind of career path? The only reason you can do this is because you're living under my roof and paying for all your expenses. You've lived a pretty comfortable life in a spot one at that. I've given you nothing but the best, and all I've asked for you is that you go for this one meeting. And you shoot it down without even thinking about it. How ungrateful of you. And your father, he was a good man, rest his soul, but useless at living. He was a bummer. I won't stand for it if you become like him. Okay, mum. Oh, the gold. Okay, mum. We're done. Going in for a meeting. I'll be home early today. You will have dinner at home, and we will take further on this. Okay. Wow. Anything here? Probably not. No. Okay, I don't think so. Okay, last one. Faith. What are you up to this weekend? 28th. Uh, swamped with my work, actually. Why? I need a favor. You always need a favor. What's new? Hey, <laughs> don't be mean. I really want to go to this gathering. You mean a party? <laughs> yeah. I'm not really up for it. But it's sort of your thing, too. What do you mean? It's Walpush Night. Walpush Night. That's, um, that's German. Something night? Not. Yeah, night. I think. Can I click on it? No, I can't. Okay, never mind. Isn't that the witch's feast? How is that my thing? You're the pagan. Hey, I follow you to church, alright? What's the big deal? Anyway, you're like, into all these supernatural stuff too. Yeah, but I don't party with ghosts. I'm not going to fall for one of your coven initiations again, Faith. Aw, oh, that was a joke. Come on. Plus, there aren't real witches. I bet I'm the only real one around here. Just some guys playing coven. We all do it, you know. Halloween. Hello. I don't know, Faith. Maybe not. Ask me again tomorrow or something. Okay, so I think that's it. Okay, uh, where else can I go? 
mail. <gasps> you just got a letter. You just got a letter. Um, doesn't matter. Juba shops here, shopping mouse. Your birthday month. Sorry about your birthday with us. Okay, doesn't matter. Foreign United, K for coffee, blah, mingles, IO, oh, dating site, let's stay out of that, buddy. Actually, hang on a second, this could be something. On mingles, your voice has three choices, there are three people who are itching to be messaged by you. Okay, no, nothing there. Uh, buddy, chainmail, hey, Sarah, I'm following this to you, from a friend, and I think you should be careful, P.S. Rihanna loves whips and chains, but I doubt her answers is out the same way. Hey, this is some really weird shit, right? Uh, do not read it, and most importantly, do not open the attachment. It can come in any shape and form, but always with a particular video attachment. It is said that whoever watches the video will bring upon a bad omen. Right. The sender will also encourage you to send the video to people you know. If you receive such content, please delete them from your phone. Only you can prevent the spread of malicious content on the web. Okay. Some ghost shit, I guess. We steal from the dead. Wow. Happy birthday, Sarah. How lucky are you for being born on Valentine's Day? You were born- Oh, no! Derek, really? It was Valentine's Day, and it was her birthday, and you fly over there to go photograph nude woman. Dude, you're such a dick. To end up alone in a tomb of a room without cigarettes or wine, just a light bulb and a pot belly, gray-haired and glad to have the room. Wow. Derek, you dick. Party invites. Uh... Ghost. On the virus note, I was referring to the computer virus sent in the 11th essay. That's not entirely true. The virus was the essay. You brought up a good point. How would a person who was cybernized at an early age like the major develop properly? I would imagine they would have left, leave the pituitary gland untouched. Overall, the in all areas of the human body and psyche would present a conundrum when cybernization is introduced into the equation. Real enough, but the man who wrote the end of verse 11, the book, Revolution, blah, blah, blah. However, the themes from the standalone. Something I have wandered off on by myself. Oh wow, that's a lot. Uh, yeah, he said a lot of stuff. Okay, anyway, moving on. Yeah, no, nah, let's not worry about that. Okay, UHS. I'll come back to it if it's important. Dear student, we are a content user. Remind us to submit your final thesis. Okay, so there's nothing in there. Uh, gallery. Oh shit, what the fuck? Failed to launch. Unfortunately, this app has stopped working. Please contact the developer for more information. What the heck? Iris. Ooh, that's not what I meant to do. Iris, I need help. Uh, I'm having some difficulty. There is something unusual about Faith and Aya's message. Oh, I'm still not done in the messages. Okay, Faith and Aya's message. Okay. Hmm. Oh, okay, because of this bit here. No? What? Uh. Okay, let's go to Faith. Uh, bub bub bub. How about this? Hey, there we go. Found something. Okay. Oh, person, I'd... Curious. Is that German? Hey, it was German, right? Yes. You are well informed. Yeah. All right. Oh, that's so clever. Uh, what is it? Walpersnacht or Walpurgis Night in English is one of the Dutch and German names for the night of the 30th of April. So called because it is the eve of the feast day of Saint Walpurga, an 8th century abbess in Francia. It is believed to be the night of a witch's meeting. Right. Why would Sarah be involved in this? Well, because she does this, um, what was it? So, um, psych psychology thing? Whatever. Freedom of religion or freedom of belief is a principle that supports the freedom of an individual or a community, public or private, to manifest religion or belief in teaching, practice, worship, and observance. It also includes the freedom to change one's religion or belief. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she's been okay. So she's been going to witch cult party things. I think there might be more clues to her whereabouts if we look through her pictures. I believe the gallery is corrupted. Would you kindly tap and hold on the gallery icon? Okay, cool. So now we can go here. Whoop. There we go. Okay, cool. About time. Please wait while I find what's wrong. Ooh, locked gallery. Uh, it seems Sarah has kept it locked. You need the passcode to proceed further. The hint oh, I know is what that is. Sarah's birthday. Uh, I'm afraid I cannot reveal personal information. You will need to find that out for yourself.
Okay, uh, well, I know what it is. Because I saw it before, it's on the 14th of the 2nd. Perhaps it is somewhere in this device. Okay, uh, boop, 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 1402? Yeah, oh yeah, right, first chat, hehe, <laughs> excellent. Why has she locked her camera? Oh, am I going to see nudie photos? Is it nudie photos? I don't want to see this. Oh, uh, well, 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 well. okay, I got to find something weird. Please don't be nudie photos, okay, so that was the horror video, let's stay away from that. Is that Derek? Little dick Derek. What are they doing? It's something, okay, they're, they're f filming. Oh, it's a kitty cat. Oh, hello, poor cat. Oh, this is for the photo on her, on her lock screen. Oh, that's so cute, but Derek's that dick. Dick Derek. Okay, so she's got some old. Why have you still got these videos? You should delete them. Part of your problem for you know moving on. You gotta get. You gotta clear everything. Get rid of everything so there's no physical memory. Okay, she's at a party. Doesn't matter. Anything else? So the question remains: Are ghosts still relevant in today's society? Well, I think we all know that ghost stories sort of started out with cavemen sitting around a fire, a campfire, telling each other these stories. To I didn't know that. Each other, right? And then it evolved into um, superstition. There was religion. The 19th century came around, and then of you course know, as it um, does. the advent around. of vampires. But vampires Ooh. reside in the night. So how is it that till today we still have ghosts, and now ghosts have actually moved over into cyberspace? Cyberspace. That's how it's relevant. Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so she's vlogging her research, I guess. Oh shit, I don't want to do that. My bad. Uh, okay, camera. Please stop the nudies. I imagine it wouldn't, otherwise it would have been a rated game, so we should be fine. Okay, any photos that are off? What's that? That's a cool tattoo. That's cool. More photos of Dick Derek. Uh, toes, Derek's into feet fetishes, it seems, or she's into foot fetishes. Uh, any more? Da, 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 da. Aha, here we go, creepy photo with a guy in a mask. Awesome. Can I click on that? No, but can I? Alright. It seems that this video correlates with a video in a message thread that Sarah has recently deleted. Would you like me to retrieve the data? Uh, uh, not now. I'll do it later in a few hours, you know, when she's dead. Of course I want you to do it now. Please wait a moment while I restore the data for you. I have successfully restored the message thread between Sarah and one of her contacts, James. The video should be in the message thread. Okay, cool. So that is in the messages section. Excelente. Whoa, that's a lot of messages. Holy shit. James. Who's James? 27th of April. Oh, that's right. This guy here. Okay. Yo, what you up to? Busy, busy? Anyway, why would you delete this? I remembered you told me you wanted to start a blog, right? About our ghost and curse research. Oh, maybe this is the guy who she's been working with and he abducted her. I don't know. I got something for you if you're interested. Blah. Hey, Jam. Yeah, I am. Better be good. Kind of. There's this thing called the Red Room. Oh, I've heard about this. Oh, no thanks. There have been reports of people dying through weird circumstances, like after checking out the weird website, you answer some stuff and then BAM! Okay, keep going. So yeah, they said that if you visit the site, your computer or phone or whatever will start freaking out, or pop-ups will start to appear and the visitor will go insane. Hang on, let me find the link to the vid. I don't want to check this! What is this? The 90s? Sounds pretty lame. I don't want to click on that, because what if that happens? No thanks. Lame, but get this. Rumor has it, have you heard of the Sasabu Slash? It's linked to the site. So when the police went through the killer's computer, the last site they found on the killer's phone was this. But still, you know how rumors can get around on the web. Maybe nothing, but I'll understand if you're scared. By the way, I've got on it. Still standing, lol. But hey, it's training now, so you might want to get dibs on this. Okay, fine, I'll check it out. I have quite high standards. I know you do. Hope you didn't go insane. I gotta go at slightly jogging at... Oh, 500. Okay, why don't you just talk like a normal person and you just, you know, call it 5 a.m. Thanks, night, Colonel Jam. Night, scary Sarah. Okay, cool. So they, they kind of got something there. Anyway, Faith. 
Yay, more messages. I don't know why you delete this either. Hey, come on, Sarah, it'll be awesome. No, it won't. Yes, it will. Don't make me put a spell on your skinny ass. What are you afraid of? But she has a big butt, according to her notes. Maybe it's just all flabby. Anyway, doesn't matter. I'm not afraid of anything, especially your fake witchery. Lies, you're the most chicken shit out of all of us, and there's nothing fake about my magic. Magica. That's not true. Yes, it is. You're scared of practically everything. Well, I'm not scared of a fucking party. Maybe. Maybe not. But you're scared of boys. No, I'm not. I'm not sure how Derek can stand you for so long. Hey, you didn't have to say that. Ooh, yeah. Sorry. Sorry, is it still too soon? Well, how long has it been? It's April. It's been like two months. Uh, two months and for 16 days. There it is. Wow, she's counting. Holy shit. Jesus, snap out of it, Sarah. Come on, let it go. We'll have some fun tonight, promise. No, I don't know. I don't know, I'd say two months, 16 days is, you know, still a mourning period. You know, like, it's only been 14, ah, uh, 16 weeks, you know. Give it, like, another month or two, it should be fine. No, I don't know, let's just go check it out. Half an hour, if it sucks, we'll bail, okay, babe? I don't trust your half hours. Put an alarm, okay? <laughs> You'll just run and become like your mum if you stay at home. Uh, that sale is it, I'm picking you up. Be ready by 8. No, no, it's okay. I'll get there myself. I'll see you there around 9. I need to have dinner first. Oh, the witch is cooking. Yeah. <laughs> the witch is the mum? <laughs> well, on the bright side, if she finally poisons you, you don't have to come. Or if you don't come, I'll assume you're dead from poison. And I'll call the cops. <laughs> alright, alright, I'll come. What are you wearing? Uh, I can tell you what I'm not wearing. S uh, slut. Bimbo slut. Fat cow. Skinny pimple booger lace vagina. And I'm out. <laughs> well, that's a... Skinny pimpled booger laced vagina. So you've got boogers, pimples, and it's skinny. Why am I thinking about this? Move it on. See you later. Don't forget to bring those penis socks you got from Tyler. What the fuck? Hey, where are you? <laughs> what? Your penis socks? These socks that have penises on them? Cool. <laughs> Why aren't you picking up? I've been got. <clears throat> Why aren't you picking up? I've been calling for 15 minutes. Faith! If you don't pick up, I'm leaving. You and your late ass. Where's the party? There's no one here. Faith, this is not funny, and I'm in the middle of the jungle, and I'm alone. Where the fuck are you? Ah, oh, okay. Play. Oh. Faith? Faith, when did you become a demon? Why'd you send a recording and not call me, Faith? Faith, you bitch! Skanky ho. Okay. Can I... No, I don't want to play it again. I just want to highlight it. Nope, can't do that either. Okay. Um... Right. What now? Oh, Iris. Please wait a moment while I restore the data for you. Ah. Oh. Oh, okay. Um... Right, well. What do I do now, Iris? Iris is offline. Great. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to check out the video? Ah, uh, okay. Ooh, ow, ow, that's it. Oh, okay, that's creepy. Ah, uh... oh, fuck. Okay, yep, I fucked up my phone. Yay. Great, now my phone's fucked. Just like I thought. Awesome. Good shit. Oh, Iris, something. <laughs> Something wrong. Uh, are you okay? What's wrong with you? Everything's wrong. I just fucked up my phone. I got a virus. My controls are malfunctioning. I just don't think it's because it's because the woman's sick. Oh, what call? I know what you mean by red room. What's the call? The call is disconnected, course. Uh, Iris, you're losing me. I found another message. This is recently deleted. This my whole it will store for you. Well, fuck. Okay. Irizu. Yay, new text to text. Hello there. Is this Sarah? I am Irizu. I received your contact from Faith. She told me you were coming for our little party, a special gathering. What time is this? 8:44. Uh. What time is this? 8.30. Oh, okay, so, so I've been texting her, and then this guy texts me when she doesn't reply. Okay. 
Uh, hey, Razoo, yeah, I'm supposed to meet her here, what's going on? I apologize, but reception here is undesirably terrible, and besides, we have a rule, no mobile phones allowed. Oh, okay, this is getting really bad, really bad, real quick. I made her escort you safely to the venue. Escort? Yes, my dear. It is hard to navigate in the dark, alone. Yep, that, that's a big indicator of something going bad. It's part of our experience. No, this just gets worse and worse and worse. I'm not sure about this. Can I talk to Faith? No, you may not. I apologize, but like I said, phones are not allowed. She is safe there, probably drunk already. Drunk? Faith doesn't get drunk. I didn't know you are really her friend. I've noticed since high school. Really? I don't think she's ever mentioned you. I keep a low profile. I'm not sure about this. I think I'll leave. That is a good decision, Sarah. You are a clever girl. Unlike some people I know who would just go on with it anyway. And then I don't have any more friends because they're all fucking dead. Anyway, <coughs> leave. Sure, you jest. Why, I am almost there. Faith will be disappointed that you didn't show up, but she has made reservations for you. Almost where? To where you are, of course. Ooh. How do you know where I am? Faith told me she was meeting you there. Okay, I'd prefer if you didn't come here. Please, I'm almost there. Please stop with you. Do not worry, you are safe. I'm gonna ring you. Please pick up. Wow, that, this guy's persistent. <laughs> ah, fucking hell. Okay. Sarah? James? Now, where are you? Uh, James? Can, can you hear me? Sarah, I'm at the cult site, Sarah! Wait, James went as well? Oh, fuck. Okay, that just get the shit out of me. <coughs> Fucking hell. Excuse me. Jesus. Whoa, hey, Sarah, why aren't you speaking? Okay. Oh, I need to talk to you. Oh, God. Oh God. Okay, he's offline. Ah, uh, boy. Whoa! Oh, oh, fucking hell! Sarah, are you there? Fuck, Sarah. Hello. Why can't I respond? Shit. Hello. Hello, James. Hold on. The fuck is that? Do you hear that? Yeah, I can. I mean, you know, your phone call is pretty fucking shit, but I heard it. Christ, what the hell? James is typing. It's urgent. Where are you? Uh, you've been missing for almost a day. Did you go to that party? Please tell me you didn't. It's real bad. Oh, crap. Oh, boy. Uh, I'm not Sarah. Uh, what? Who are you? Uh, just someone trying to help you find Sarah. Yep. Oh, crap. I guess I have to trust you. We'll get back to... We'll get back to who you are later. Here, check this out. I don't want to check that out, man! I don't want to check it out. I guess I have to. Oh. As those Whoa. who are trying to prepare themselves for entry into... Um... Ooh. Ooh, this is scary. Holy shit. Oh my god. I almost lost my phone before. I guess that's why they say play with a strap. <laughs> oh god, okay, um... Mail. Uh, research materials? Hey, Scary Sarah, I thought this might interest you. Bunch of material for your research. Okay, what's this? Symbols. Cool, don't know what it means, but whatever. What's this? James sent me this. March 20th date varies. Spring equinox, orgies, oral, anal, vagina, any age, male or female, human or... Animal, right, okay, is this a calendar of all the things that this cult's gonna do? Uh, Shrofetide, three days before Ash Wednesday. Good Friday, Day of Passions, Death of Christ, Blood, Human Sacrifice, Male, Adult, Only. James is an adult? What's today? Is today Friday? It's not a good Friday, so it doesn't matter. Uh, Easter Eve Day, Blood, Human Sacrifice, Male, male or Female, Adult, Abduction, Ceremonial, Preparation and holding of sacrificial victim. Well, not April. St. Mark's Eve, divining and herb gathering, grand climax, demure, oral, anal, vaginal, corpus de bat, 1 to 25 female. Oh man. Oh, April the 3rd, Walpus Nut, Blood Mist Day, Root Mist Day, I saw blood. Root Mist Day, Blood, Animal, Animal, Human Sacrifice, Any Age. Oh shit, okay, so that's what's happening at the moment, is the Walpus Nut. Okay, uh, Bilton Eve, often celebrated with a festival that includes bonfires and fertility rites, greatest witches, Sabbath, 
versus May Belt and World Purges Day May Day Druid Fire Festival Coven Initiations. Right, so sacrifices, yay. Um, 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 um. Oh, I can. Okay, cool. Hey, James, what does this mean? What am I looking at? This is disturbing. <laughs> this is disturbing. Uh, oh shit, I see them. See who? What? What? Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Dude, if you see people who are gonna kill you, do text! You won't believe this guy. James, you're a fucking idiot. Stop texting me. I wanna send something to him, but I don't wanna make sounds on his phone which will lure me, lure them to his location. Uh, calm down. Stop fucking texting me, dude. Oh fuck, I think they saw me. Well, that's what you get when you keep texting. You know, bright screen and all. Idiot. Uh, who? I don't want to send texts, but I feel like I have to. And this phone life, holy crap, it's like 23% this entire time. Man, this is, a, this is a good battery for a phone. No, they didn't. Jesus, that was fucking close. I'm hiding behind this. I don't know what it, this is. Maybe a... Maybe it was a pile of corpses. <laughs> like, I hear a sound. Oh, okay, oh, great. Great. Oh, are they behind him? Oh, shit. James? James, boy? James? J James, you there? Hello, hello. Oh, no. Welcome, dear uninvited friend. Ah, oh, shit. James! Uh, who is this? Oh, man. He's been caught. I apologize for the sudden urgency I'm about to bestow onto you. Oh, crap. What are you talking about? What you talking about, boy? What you want about? Say hello, hello to James, or hello, 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 hello. Awesome. Well, I found myself a new screensaver. <laughs> What's going on? Hey, this is interesting. What the fuck? What's this? Hmm, interesting. Yes. Share this link with another. Anyone? Everyone, red room, or say goodbye to a brief acquaintance. Oh, you have two minutes. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Wait, hang on a sec. That's, that's the link that I got told about. Please, whoever you are. Wait, what? 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 Please, whoever you are, do not do this. Okay, so I don't share the link. Because whoever gets it ends up uh, being cursed and shit. But I really want to send it to Buddy and Derek. Do I send it to Buddy? I I mean I could I mean he's a dickhead, but is uh, do I want to be the cause of his of his death? You know, like I've got two minutes. Ah, fuck shit. What do I do? It says don't do it, so I can't do it. Oh god. Oh shit. Um. Okay, hang on a sec. Do I let James die? Or do no no no? Because if I send it to another person, then another person will die. So if I let one person die then that's the least amount of people who die. Okay, so I'm not gonna share it. As much as I want freaking Buddy to die, but Buddy would then have to share it as well. And no, Buddy, he's probably a pussy-ass little bitch and will probably send it to everybody on his contacts. So, no. Not gonna do it. Haha! -ha. I beat your game, game. I ain't gonna play this. You can kill James, which I'm kind of sad about, actually, because I was kind of hoping that James and Sarah could, you know, be together. Because they work together, and they have similar interests, and they seem... Uh, they got cute little nicknames and all that. I think it was them with the nicknames. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. But anyway, um... Jesus, how long do I have to wait? Two minutes? Like, actual two minutes? I suppose it's going to give me time. Alright, let's just... Uh, what else can I do? Oh! What else can I do? Not do it? Iris? Ah, oh, she's offline. Awesome. Awesome. James sent a photo. No, he didn't. This is the same one as before. I can zoom in. Hey, guy. Hey. Hey, how's it going? Oh. Oh, shit, is he dead? Oh, he's dead. Oh. Uh, I did it. Is he dead? No, what the, he died any, oh wait, of course he died. Duh. I never think that people die, they just go to the department store. Okay, Iris. Okay. Uh, it is me again, it is you. Oh, are you the person who's been texting me? 
Shit. Uh, Erezu, what do you want? It is me again. I apologize for not introducing myself. How rude of me. What do you want? You sick bastard. Probably shouldn't, um, piss the guy off. And almost like love, dying without apparent pain, wondering, as the world goes by without a curled smile, if anyone else saw or sensed my crime. Okay, why is it like orange? My name is Irizu. I am one of the, how do you say, um, leaders for tonight's ceremony. We have met on a very fortunate night. Cherish this moment, my stranger friend. You fucking crazy, you just killed someone. Me? Kill? <laughs> Never. Do not take me as a lowly murderer. Please, do not misunderstand my intentions. Uh, then why kill that poor man? Oh, then why? It was James. He was an innocent man. As I said before, I do not kill. That man was anything but poor. He was a deceiver. All these choices, but what do these options mean? Alright, that's why you're talking shit. All these choices what does mean to you. Is this your demonstration of free will? I feel like God now. Wow. Okay, I'll just put that in. Can I say anything else? Nope. Alright, so it's offline again. Yay, okay, back to Irizu. Whoop. He was a deceiver. How so? What did he do? Did he lie to you or something? That doesn't mean that he should die. Well, it depends. Really. <laughs> How so? What did he do? You'll never be privy to that information, my young friend. Nor will you need it to further your quest. What are you talking about? What you talking about? What quest? What you talking about, boy? What you want about? Where are my manners? I have told you my name, but not what I do. I fear that my age has somewhat dulled me to these simple talks. Small talk, as you call it. It does not matter much what I do, but what's important for you to know, my young friend, is that you, like everything else in this world, you have a choice. I'm here to offer you that choice. What should I listen to you? You didn't offer James much of a choice. Hmm, I feel like I shouldn't piss him off. What choice? You might get mad, and then kill people, and that's or not kill people, <laughs> which is like really weird. The choice is simple, yet not. Okay, what will you make me do this time? A leap of faith. We are almost out of time. So here it is. He doesn't seem very mad that I didn't send the links. Would you like to join us? I believe you have the potential. It is rare for me to offer this to someone who is uninitiated. Yes or no? Simple, yet not. Mm, well, it's a cult of Satanists. But I don't know what religion or group of Satanists, because there are so many. You'll find out soon enough, if you have your wits about you. Quickly now. Yes or no? Uh, no, you can fuck off. You crazy bastards. Uh, no, let's just say I can't do this, no. I don't want to piss him off. I need to keep him happy, or calm. Pity. What if life itself was in the balance? You, you gonna make me join? Say these two young ravishing women. Oh, shit. Find Sarah. Oh, okay, one of them Sarah. You choose between them. Who lives to see the sun rise tomorrow? Oh, great. You maniac, you said you do not kill. That's a good point. Then you just say you are not a killer. How do I choose? Oh, crap. Oh, shit. But I don't. It is not my choice. Sacrifice is not the act of pure destruction. It is merely a transformation. Life is perpetual. Wow, that's bullshit. I leave it up to you. God himself makes these decisions all the time, does he not? Why not ease some of the work for him? Or her? Or it? However it is that you see your God. Sarah or Faith? Their names mean nothing to you, but to us they are what binds them to this flesh and mud. Say one of their names and know that it will be their last breath. Say one of their names and know that- Okay, so if I choose Faith, it kills Faith. If I choose Sarah, it kills Sarah. Okay, can't mess that up. There's no sweeter invite than a last breath to welcome you. One passes and another comes. What to say you? Why me? This is freaking stupid. I love this! Hey, I love this so much I get to choose who dies. <laughs> Why me? Why? Why not? You know, like, why not? It is fun! For you, perhaps. Since you're here anyway, just why not choose? 
This is what happens when you go, you know, picking up people's phones. You get into shit like this. Everything in life is a choice. Whether you join us or not, it makes no difference. Yes or no. Okay, so it doesn't matter if I choose or not. One of them's gonna die. You have 10 seconds. Oh shit. Um, uh, if I choose Faith, I'll, I'll kill Faith because the point of the game is to save Sarah. I'm sorry, Faith. I'm sorry. But I'm supposed to save Sarah. Did I fuck it up? I'm supposed to choose Faith, right? If I choose Faith, Faith dies? Yes? 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 Yes. Okay. Uh, the deed is done. Welcome, my child. You're indeed a rare being. Save Sarah. Okay. Whew, I thought I fucked that up. Ugh. Answer me this. Why did you choose Faith? Because the game says to do so. Because my memos tell me to do so. My daily reminders. Just, just in case I forget, because, you know, I have amnesia. I forget these things sometimes. So I put notes in my daily reminders to tell me that I'm supposed to save Sarah. You know, just in case I, 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 I was confused. I wanted to see what you would do to her. I wanted to see her die. It is all meaningless in the end. These aren't good questions. These are all negative ones. Where's, where's the, like, the positive hearty hero type choice? It's all meaningless in the end. Yes, I, I mean, that's like the closest option to not so negative. But well, that's pretty negative. But it may seem meaningless for now. But life has as much meaning as we put into it. Come now to these coordinates. Uh, virus is red. It's a tough choice. Sometimes, but has to be done. Sometimes, Sarah means too much to me. Well, I'm glad I didn't piss you off. It hurts to see Faith go. Sarah knew Faith for the longest time. I mean, yeah, that's why I feel really bad. I mean, I feel bad because I had to kill her. Well, I didn't kill her, but I had to choose, but... Ugh. I don't want to do this, I don't want anyone to die, I hope Faith doesn't mind. <laughs> She's dead! She can't mind! Oh, that's a silly answer. It's funny, but silly. Life hurts a lot more than death. This is true. At least Sarah is okay. We need to find her quick. Well, I found the location. So that's good. Yeah, can I click on this now? No. Oh, shit! What the fuck? Um... What I do? Yeah, it's the first of May. <laughs> okay. So that yeah, that's the whole thing. You've made it this far. Too bad you won't make it much further. But now that you have now become part of something much larger, all will be revealed in due time, but not this instant. Any last words, as you humans are so fond of leaving words behind. Oh, this is the song in her phone. And by the third message. I'm guessing there's going to be more to this game. I'm assuming this is the end. I'm awestruck. I feel empty on more death. Wow. It was good, but I'm awestruck. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Not that I don't love our little chat. It's just... I don't love them. Okay. Is this the game? Yeah, it is. That's the game. Wow. Okay. That is... Sarah is missing. Oh, and we're back. Wow, that was whew, that was pretty rough, actually. That was, that was good. That was awesome. That was really different. It was so exciting playing it on the phone. You know, against that real immersiveness. That was awesome. That was a cool game. I wonder how many other endings there were. I mean, obviously you could kill Sarah, not Faith. So I'm curious to see what that's like. Wow, that was really immersive on the phone. I just threw it across the room a couple of times when, like, the phone rang. It scared the shit out of me. That would have sucked, because that's an expensive phone, too. Whew. I wonder if there's anything I missed. I don't know. Ah, far out. I, uh, I don't know what to say. That's kind of an ab abrupt ending, I guess. Like, I think I could have done a little bit more. And that location, I don't know where that was. Maybe there's something on the page. Uh, hang on a sec. Okay, so apparently this is the place here. It's in Malaysia somewhere, which is pretty creepy, actually. Like, it's an actual place, which is pretty cool, I guess. It's pretty weird, which is a forest of some sort, which is, is really weird because that's fucking creepy because she was actually there and she got lost in the forest and then those creepy cultist guys were like, oh, wait, we're going we're gonna to sacrifice y'all because we're, we're fucking crazy. <laughs> 
Holy shit, okay, well, there you go, that is, Sarah is missing, I hope you guys enjoyed this, I, this was different, I enjoyed it, this was cool. Thanks Kyle for suggesting this game to me, this was pretty cool, this is awesome, I'll leave a link in the description to this page where you can see it right there, so if you guys want to go check it out for yourself, go do it, and if you can, get it on your phones because that experience was awesome, I don't know what it's like on the computer, but holy shit, that was cool, that was cool. But yeah, so go off and play for yourself, see if you guys can get different endings, because I don't know how many other endings there are. Two, obviously, you choose Sarah or Faith, or maybe you don't choose her at all, so three endings, there you go. Um, but I don't know how many more th how many more there are. I guess I got the a good ending, maybe you can save everyone, I don't know. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, I appreciate it, subscribe for more, share it around, that, that helps me out greatly, appreciate it a lot. Cheers, guys. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video of whatever I make. Until then, bye-bye!